How to Party Like a Snail, written by Nassim Kharab, illustrated by Kelly Collier. Snail is a party animal. Yippee! Well, kind of. He especially loves the quiet things about parties, like confetti, using his indoor voice to make new friends, psst, hello, do you hear something? Whispering meaningful wishes to cakes, I wished for more cake, and savoring those few silent seconds before everyone yells, surprise, three, two, but parties aren't often quiet, and sometimes things can get too loud for Snail. That's when he shrinks into his shell. From inside his shell, Snail still finds a way to join the fun. This is my jam! Bop dee bop bop! Too bad no one can see his sweet dance moves. Sometimes, Snail's friends try to coax him out. Come on out, everyone's dancing. I'm partying in my heart. It sure doesn't look that way. It's just that things get a bit too loud for me sometimes. But loud is fun. It sure is, especially when it's less loud. Okay, well, enjoy your, er, uh, quiet. They say silence is golden, right? I don't get it. Meh. And that makes him wonder if he's the only one who thinks that quiet is just as fun as loud. Lately, Snail hasn't been invited to many parties. Instead, he spends a lot of time waiting. I hear that the mail can be awfully slow sometimes. And waiting. And waiting. Until one day, the smail carrier finally arrives with a promising looking envelope for Stump. Meep. Here, Stump. This came to me by mistake. Not another one. Snail is starting to think that he's more of a party pooper than a party animal. It's not a party without Stump. Sniff. The only type of party he feels like going to now is his own pity party. And that gives Snail an idea. What if he threw his own party? It'll be the funnest, quietest party I've ever been to. First, he invites himself. Ooh, a party for me? I love me. Then he makes a pot of warm milk. Mm, a hug in a mug and lip syncs to all of his favorite lullabies. Snail is having so much fun that things start to get wild. Let's make this party even quieter. To hype up the hush, Snail fluffs some pillows and rolls himself up in a blanket burrito. A soft shell! He's almost having the time of his life, but he can't help feeling like something is missing. I've got my shower, my milk, my blankies, my lollies. What could be missing? Is it too quiet? Could I miss the loud? Do I miss the loud? <gasps> Am I loud? And that's when Stump gently chimes in with a suggestion. Maybe your party is just missing a friend? Stump, you're here! Shall come to my party! Well, I'm always here since I'm rooted in the ground, but your shindig is filled with all my favorite things. Snail and Stump realize that they both love parties, but just not the rowdy ones. Shall we shh together? Sure! <laughs> In celebration of the shush, Snail and Stump play an exhilarating game of hide 
and hide. Ready or not? Here we hide. Put on their favorite jammies. I feel like a marshmallow. Wrapped in a cloud. And then turn the lullabies way down. We, we can, can barely, barely hear, hear them. them. We're total party animals. <coughs> Snail and Stump party in their hearts. All night long. <laughs> <laughs>